Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Last we left off, we had just ranked up to rank 3, I believe, and now we're getting an email from, uh, Mystery X or whatever the heck. So we're gonna go ahead and answer that, because this gets really annoying real quick. Oh, it's not from Mystery Man X. This is your last warning. Stop snooping around about this crystal star. If you don't, you'll suffer the same fate as the others who have gone missing. Great. Our angry pen pal again. He sure seems to have a lot of information. I mean, if he knows about the crystal star and the missing fighters, and this guy's totally holding the key to this entire mystery. But like, who is it? Who? Yeah, I'm thinking it's Jolene, but maybe not. She was kind of conveniently near where, um, where we were supposed to go either way. Yeah, Jolene was kind of near. Oh, whoops. When I was thinking something's cool, I always say it's spiketastic. It might catch on. Okay. Um, uh, she was definitely like, you know, a bit suspicious, especially with the way she's acting, but also kind of useful? She sent away that guard that was there. Uh, let's go ahead and reserve a match. We might be able to finish this all in this episode. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fix him for a fight, huh? Well, all right, and then let me just see who your next opponent is. Uh, rank two, chomp. Okay, so it's a chain chomp. I want you to avoid using your hammer. Not even once, son. I want to see how you do when you ain't got something to beat a fellow with. Now get in there and let's see some acrobat flying. Okay. Uh, oh, it's Miss Jolene. Interesting. Pardon me, Mr. Gonzalez. Another gift arrived from one of your admirers. I'll just leave it over here, if that's okay. Do with it what you will. Another cake. Um. Wow, way to go, baby. You gotta block out how much better you are than me. Uh. Oh, wow, looks totally yummy. I cannot say no to cake. Let's scarf that thing. No. What's your deal, Mario? I'm totally starving here. Are you watching carbs? Well, I mean, in real life, yes, I'm absolutely watching my weight, but either way, we'll just go ahead and continue on the way. Mr. Gonzalez, it's time for your next match. Come with me. I can't remember who the... I know Jolene, like, is involved in this story somehow, but I can't remember how. Um, and that sounds so fake, but, like, I legitimately cannot remember how. Um, for our next battle, we got the Merciless Gladiator Gonzalez, the Red Ore Fear Orbs, yep, a fight with to the finish with Chomp Count Country. Okay. Okay, we'll, we'll be okay here. Or, 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 or they're literally dogs. We're literally fighting dogs. This is a this is a, a dog, a dog pit or whatever the heck it's called. It's not okay. This is not cool. Okay, so we can't use our hammer, so we'll have her tattle just right off the bat. Uh, line up the small cursor as long as we don't mess this up somehow and get this stylish. That's a red chomp. It's a rabid, red biting, chewing, chomping fool. Max HP is six. Attack is five. Defense is three. The attacks are so powerful we could be in a world of hurt if we don't beat it fast. Which is why it's really, really lame that its defense is so high. Its HP is pretty low, though, so items and special moves might just work. Just look at that color. Think someone painted it after it fell asleep at a party? Um, okay, so we can't use our hammer, but that doesn't mean we can't use our specials. So maybe... Huh, maybe we'll switch out to Sephiroth. No, because he'll get he'll get wrecked. So maybe Earth Tremor? Um, I'll leave this in, I guess, because it's early on, but we'll see how good I can do. I feel like last time I did this while I was talking... I actually did fairly well. I just went silent when I had to press the buttons, which is me, like, trying to make sure that I actually press the button. Um, because it is actually very difficult. Especially since it progressively gets faster like that. Um, actually really freaking annoying. Uh, okay. Oh, no. No, no, no. Okay. Is it really using an item? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Okay, so we can't use our hammer. She only does two damage. So we're gonna go ahead and switch out to Sephiroth. Um, I can't switch if he's attacking first, but I'm gonna try to see if maybe I can take out this bad boy before he hits. Because, oh sweet, okay. Oh, wait, it has three. Oh, so I, oh right, I deal six damage with that one. Oh, dang it, I couldn't do the thing. Oh well. Um, I was gonna use Gulp. Actually, yeah, Gulp should be fine. It does four damage. Otherwise, it, it doesn't do enough damage. Wow, that's wow, just straight up dealt four damage. Okay, so now we're... Oh, we're ten points away, so maybe if we level up before the end... We got ourselves a winner, the Great Gonzalez. Alrighty, so now we should be good. I think we should get another email as well. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzalez. Yeah, see, okay, I knew one of those cakes was going to be bad. You received 15 coins, and our rank rose to two. Um, so yeah, this guy's on his back. Uh, let's see what he has to say. By the way, Gonzalez, see see the dude on the floor back there? Ugh, body went numb, stupid cake, hate cake, never eat cake again. 
Yeah, see? I knew one of those cakes was bad. Is that cake poisoned? Yeah, it must have been. If we'd eaten it, we'd be all banged up like that guy. So then, yeah, Jolene is the bad guy. Okay. Oh, uh, wow, we've had- we've made quite the amount of money, actually. So we'll take a rest so that we can heal up little Sephiroth there. So now we should be fine. Um... I think we just keep on fighting, because we haven't gotten a message from, uh... From Anonymous X. Well, boy howdy. Uh... Rank 3. Wait, what? I want you to avoid using your hammer. Not even once, son. Did I mess up somehow? Okay, so we can't use our hammer. I thought I didn't- So we can't use our hammer. That's weird. I'm gonna try to see if maybe I can take out this bad boy before he hits. Did I not have to switch partners? I don't- Oh, you know what? I don't- No, it said don't use your Oh, I used my hammer. I'm an idiot. I'm actually an idiot. Okay, we're skipping. Okay, so I accidentally leveled up. I completely forgot- oh, whoops. <clears throat> I completely forgot that I was on the verge of leveling up either way. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and probably choose some more bro points. I'm tempted to do health, just because I know I seem to be struggling with taking a lot of hits recently. Um, maybe I'll do f no, uh, I'm thinking bro points- or not bro points. I'm thinking of- I have Superstar Saga on the mind. I definitely want to play that game at some point, too. So we became a B-list star. Next battle, Mario's crowd and stage will be bigger. Oh, so our stage is bigger too. Interesting. But great. Okay, so we won. And this time I didn't use an item. Uh, last time I wasn't supposed to use a hammer. Uh, but at least we got more money. I like money. Money's fun. So we'll go ahead and get our next match because I messed up that one. Um, oh, the Koopanator. Okay. Now listen, son. In this battle, I want you to keep that part of yours from attacking. Oh, so no attacks from... You hear me? Keep that little fire brand in check. Got it? Only you attack. Now get in there and show him who's boss. Oh, and I know I can't, um... You. How dare you interfere with my meditation. Time is too precious to squander on one such as you. Um, so it looks like... I, I guess I'll stick with, um... Is Tattle considered an attack? I don't want to have to do this again. So you know what? We'll stick with, um... We'll stick with, uh... With S Sephiroth. Oh, he didn't... Oh, yeah. He told me to go with him. Okay. <clears throat> Um, from the looks of it, after this, we'll be fighting, uh, the number one. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzalez, and the Razor Blade Brigadier. Yep, a fight to the finish with the Koopanator. Okay, let's see here. You finally get a piece of you. Finally, we'll see who's truly stronger. Alrighty, let's go. This guy's a bit of a... of a blowwad, a tryhard, who knows. Um, all I know is I can't let... Oh, wait, I can't let him attack. Oh... So tell you what, just right off the bat, we'll do Earth Tremor then. Okay, we'll skip to when I'm done. Or actually, we'll, I'll try talking over it. I seem to do better when I talk over it for some reason. As long as I'm not, like, like too anxious about doing it. Um, the issue is, like, I already have very poor, um, uh, like, reaction time. But see, like, ones like this make me really nervous. Uh, especially, you see what I mean? Like, I just blow it so hard on that one. It's just so difficult to do, but we did four damage. I don't know how much health he has. Um, I guess we can have him appeal. He'll be an appeal machine. Also, it said the stage would be bigger. Oh, that is such BS. Don't give me that BS. I guess we'll do um, Power Smash because I don't know how much health this guy has. See how annoying it is to not know how much... Oh, you're kidding me. I got dizzied. Um, see how annoying it is to not have, like, a... Uh, there we go, I managed to counter. Uh, see how annoying it is not knowing how much HP, like, your enemy has, like, you don't know how, how far you have to go, like, how much damage you- Oh, right, I miss now. Uh, you can go ahead and appeal again. I mean, that's all he's kind of good for. There we go, managed to counter again. Um, oh, what's going on here? I don't know what's going on there. We're, we're just gonna keep on trying to power smash, because, uh, at the end of the day... If I still manage to hit him despite being dizzy, it's still a, a plus one for me. You can appeal again, and see, we can do Sweet Treat if you have to. And, um... Oh, jeez, I didn't get it that time. Okay. Um, so we can't let him attack, but... I guess we'll do another Power Smash? And maybe I'll have, um... My other boy there do the item for me. Oh! Wow. Wow, are you actually kidding? Are you... Oh, okay, thank god. Um, he has... he's been beefed up quite the amount. So, I really... Really gotta heal myself somehow. Um... 
I guess maybe we'll give him a mushroom? That should be able to get him through just enough. Um... Yeah, it doesn't look like... Oh, I couldn't do the thing. Yeah, that would have killed me otherwise. That would have been real bad. Uh, let's go ahead and do our power smash again. See, like, it's so... Oh, we beat him. Okay, sweet. We got 11 whole points, and we just barely beat him. That would have been so bad if I died there. I would have gotten so annoyed. Alrighty. So now we get to move on, and the next dude we beat is, uh... Uh, the Rock Hawk. After that. There we go. So I think... Oh no, so we don't get to move on, but we are number one now. Um, oh, there it is. Uh, let's see who it's from. Remove the Great Gonzalez poster in the lobby. From X. From X this time, huh? That guy still sounds like a nut, but hey, that's all we got. Sounds good to me, let's hit the lobby. Okay, so I guess I have to peel off the posters? So I know exactly what that means. That means we need Flurry! I forget what the heck I was talking about. All I know is, like, I remember doing the, the, Earth, the Earth Tremor thing and being like, oh, yeah, I guess, uh... I guess we'll, uh... I guess I'll try talking over it, but it's so difficult. And I think even before this, I was, um... Oh, please don't tell me I have to do them one by one. Are you... You are actually kidding me. Uh, mystery and all that, like, especially with, um... Portal, and then once we got Portal 2, oh sweet, there's another key. A uh, key that opens a door in the Gliss Pit storage room. Whatever could that key be for? Oh, here we go. Go to the second floor of the storage room from X. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to our little boy in red here. Um, I really wish I'd gotten the black one, but you know what? At the end of the day, the red one's pretty cool too, just because he has the black diaper. And I also find it kind of funny that he has a diaper to begin with. Because it's like, uh, you can tell it's a baby. And yet when I got that kiss from Miss Mouse, he was like, Man, I want one of those kisses. Those kisses, it's like, it was kind of creepy. Kind of a bit creepy. Um, because it's literally five. It's not even five, it's like one or something like that. Um, here we go. I'm gonna open, oh, come on. I'm gonna open this door. And I think now we get to see the true secrets of this place. Um, yeah, we gotta use, uh, our boy here. And then we come across, and then uh, we uh, dismount him. Then we do our spinny, and then we go. Yep. Whoa! You gotta be kidding me! Brand Bandy Andy and King K? Ugh. Oh boy. They're just both silent. Gun Gonzalez, listen to me. Ugh, man, don't get near the ring when no one is around. Oh. Come on, shake it off, buddy. What do you mean, don't go near the ring? There you go. I also find it kind of weird that, like, they have, uh... They have flies circling around them, almost like they're dead bodies. Oh! Gonzalez, you see that? That was Jolene! This is craziness. What is going on here? Yeah, exactly. For a mushroom, she moves pretty damn fast. Well, I'll tell you guys what. We'll end it here for now. I get the feeling this is all coming to a head, so next episode is probably going to be the last one for Chapter 3. So, see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.